what we're going to discuss now is we're going to talk about balance. So as we get into our flat ground routine, we're incorporating our delivery and the first portion of it would be the drop step and then how we're going to get to the top of our delivery. I think the top of the delivery is totally individualized per the person. So for certain guys, the leg lift could be shorter. That's the top of their delivery. For other guys that have loose hip flexors and have athleticism and energy to what they're doing, it could be way up here, which I can't get my leg up there. So the bottom line is we want to stay on our center. So the center point of what we're doing is we want to be on the center of our foot, the core, and we want to use the ground as creating a center so we can eventually work around our core. So the top of the delivery is extremely important. We need to get things done at the top of our delivery. And when I say th things done, I mean ball glove separation before we start to go forward. So what we are trying to understand is we're trying to understand how we're getting to the top, how what kind of movements we're doing to get to the top, how much energy is being created because the leg lift should just fly up. It should just lift. We shouldn't have to force it up. Then we're trying to understand the timing and the rhythm within the space of here and what we're going to do as far as getting the ball out of the glove before this starts to go forward, which will continue to add closure and backside involvement, which will give us the best opportunity to execute pitches out front.